Hey folks, welcome back to another tour here of one of our models at San Antonio Ridge. As always, I'm John Klein, Director of Sales here uh, and your resource for all things senior living. I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Place really turned out sharp. I think you'll like what you see. Uh, certainly if you have any questions or comments, leave them below in this video. And if you haven't already, please be sure to follow our YouTube page or follow our Facebook page as well. It would be greatly appreciated. Thanks so much. Enjoy. Okay, so here we are in front of the Crest model currently. It's in this nice little courtyard area that you see. Uh, all the Crest models, if they do not do not have a garage, uh, they do have these longer front porches that you can fit quite a bit of patio furniture onto, which are very nice. So as we enter into the front door here, It's a little foyer area as I'm closing this back up so you can see. So plenty of wall space to put anything for, you know, keys or um, any sort of shelving just for a nice little entry area. Okay, you have a switch here for your entry light. Uh, as we walk in, you kind of see as I'm quick panning around and get more detail, but that's the dining room living area. We do have this nice uh, rustic called an LVP floor. It's a plank flooring. It is an option for folks as you're looking at the homes. Okay. So first we'll start off in the kitchen. Um, everything's full size appliances, just like all the other videos. There is a dishwasher currently missing just because it's not ordered yet uh, or hasn't come in yet. Sorry. Uh, but everything else is now a new standard. So uh, even something new that we just added is that nice under cabinet lighting that you see. Uh, very nice and bright. Uh, you're getting a lot of natural light in from the window right now, so it's harder to see, but it's very nice little add-in. You have a nice pendant light, nice center light there with crown molding painted. Um, really nice countertops, um, nice and deep, and especially this back corner one, very deep corners. Really nice slate appliances. Everything's full size, um, like you've seen in my other videos. Glass tops. Again, that's all standard, okay? They have these nice corner cabinets, nice big, deep, lazy Susan. So a ton of room back there for pots and pans. Um, this is just a single bowl sink. That's our standard faucet. Uh, all the homes come with a garbage disposal as well. So as I pan back around, you kind of see it's a more of an open floor plan in the crest, just similar to the Longwood too. So you have your nice dining area here, um, plenty of space for even a bigger table than that, but that really fits the space nice. A nice chandelier hanging over top of it. Another standard we started adding in is just that recess lighting you see in the main area uh, before that was not there. Uh, it was just wall, I mean, four lamps that were hooked into the wall with to a switch. So that's a nice add-in. Really gives you some nice lighting in this main flooring area here. Um, also, you'll see full-size couch. Uh, nice seating area there with a Good size TV, so plenty of space for a living area for chairs. Another chair over there. It's plenty of wall space, okay? And we'll take you back into this sunroom. Just a patio enclosure. It does have heat and air. Um, we have a little corner covered there. Just give you an idea what you could put in, but I'll just quick pan around, okay? You have a nice storm door there. It goes out to the outside. This does have heat and air. Not every single one of them do, but uh, they're a very nice little extra added space to extend some seasons out, give you some extra living space as well. Okay, so that's just everything, kitchen, dining, living room area. Very nice, very open. Okay, so we'll head back down the hall here. You have a good size hall closet, vacuum, things like that. Obviously coats. Um, Nice hallway here. That is a pull down attic again. Um, those are the width of the home, so there's a good amount of size up there for Christmas decorations, luggage, that kind of stuff. Uh, in here, we'll go in here first. This is the laundry room. Okay, there is a little pocket door here, so you can close that off if you'd like. On the opposite end of this laundry room, we have set up like a little office area. Okay, so plenty of space here really to put you know, chest freezer, office area, um, some options you can make this a half bath. Uh, so just a nice little bit of extra space in this laundry room, actually very big. Okay, pan around again. Here's your laundry area, and obviously the breaker box. Um, something I point out in our how to use videos, 
most times your attic light is up here in your laundry room so you can see that red light flips on and off okay um, across the hall is the one of the bedrooms we have it set up like just like a little office or den so like a little tv room here uh, both bedrooms are the same size okay have a nice uh, five foot closet in there okay so very nice and this one also has a ceiling fan so it is an option that you get we have these carpeted in the bedrooms and I'll go over to what the other bedroom is. This is a, a full full size bed. So a queen would be the same length, just a little bit wider, but enough room to fit a chest of drawers, nice end table, and then this nice dresser here. Uh, and this isn't on end, so you do have two windows, which is nice for some natural light. Um, and also another five foot closet there, okay? And back out into the hallway here, we have Basically, would set up like a little linen because there isn't a linen closet in the bathroom in this one. Some do have that, uh, but that's nice. Some extra shelving in there. Um, so a really great space to have linens and other extra items that you need, you know, a good amount of space in there. And then this is the bathroom. <clears throat> so this has a high toilet. Um, we also added like a little grab bar you see on the wall here, just in case that's needed. Uh, everything's new and updated, all new vanity, cabinetry in there, new lighting. Uh, again, this have the medicine cabinets here. You can see it's shelving in there, okay? And then this has, don't mind the painter's tape because they're gonna come fix a couple spots that we always do. Um, but this has a nice grab bar and then this has a tub cutout that's added in. So that's a cheaper option than doing a walk-in shower if the home already doesn't have that. Um, and it makes it nice to get in and out of of the tub if you're not going to use it anymore for a shower and this has a nice little window on the end because it is like i said an end so looks outside okay so that's that's the crest model uh very nice very good size again open floor plan your laundry room and your bathrooms are bigger which is really nice again i'll go back through the laundry room washer dryer on this side and then you have this really big area over here that you can do a lot of things with which is nice and then the bathrooms are, are certainly a good size as well. And then it's more of an open floor plan out here. You have your dining and living space. Okay, very nice. And then a good L-shaped kitchen where a lot of people on this left side will put a little floating island or they'll put a little eating kitchen, like a drop leaf table. There's plenty of room to do that. Um, so again, just another nice option that we offer here at Sanatoga Ridge for your cottages. Uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, and certainly, if you have more questions, reach out to me, number 610-326-6282. Thanks so much for watching.